Hey everyone, welcome to Positron Plays Grime. This is an action-adventure platformer. Look, it's a Metroidvania Souls-like. Let's, let's be honest. Well, this came out last year, actually, but um, I didn't get to play it at the time. I really, really enjoyed the demo. Um, so I figured, what the heck, let's go back and play it. Be a <laughs> good tonal shift from Tunic, I guess. Uh, this has a, a really interesting and bizarre aesthetic to it. As we're going to see uh, immediately. There's a lot of uh, rock mass, I guess, is the way to put it. It's it's very bizarre. There's also a lot to do with the uh, the breadth and mass of these rock creations. That's about the extent I know of it. Hey, that's us. Yeah, I feel like that's some mornings too. As always with new stuff, you can let me know if you want some uh, audio tweaks and such. I'm trying to, to balance the sound a little bit because some of the gameplay is pretty quiet, but there's also some pretty high points, so. All right. In fact, I actually... Turn those up a little bit. Yeah, so this is us. We are this uh, rock creature. I don't know what the heck we are. Uh, and yes, we do in fact have a black hole for a noggin. And that is a key uh, part of the game, which is interesting. Yeah, so absorb. So we have a parry maneuver, in a sense. Um, and that parry maneuver is to absorb things. Um, and we just suck them into our noggin. There's another rock creature there. This is his head is all wrong. So it's going to take me a little bit to get used to the timing on this, I think. But um, relatively speaking, the timing on the absorb seems pretty lenient, I would say. Yeah, absorbing enemy steals their breath. And press right trigger to con convert a full breath meter into health. So this is sort of our, uh, our Estus flask. You know what, boy, the game is really quiet once you're in here, isn't it?
Uh, we can actually look at enemies that we have started absorbing. So we've got a boulder head. We've got a frail arm. Uh, my understanding is that once we uh, absorb enough of a creature, uh, we can gain powers from it to some extent. Can we get across there? I don't think so. Whoops. Okay. I don't believe I can air dash. No. I can backstep. Um, and it does use... Oh, jumping uses a little bit of stamina too. That's interesting. I really like the way that they have the uh, the ledges and stuff. Like you're kind of explained being able to jump through these ledges because they're actually in the background to an extent. It's really interesting. It's good utilization of uh, kind of multiple layers. All right, so we imprint ourselves on this stone. Um, and I think these stones are basically bonfires. Um, and then we can level up. So we've got health. Explanatory. Force, I think, is uh, like stamina. Strength, dexterity, and resonance. So uh, I'm going to guess this is kind of like, you know, standard strength, standard dexterity. Resonance is probably like... Maybe magic style? Um, I tend to like dexterity type of things um but we'll see i'll probably throw a point in, in health to start uh i do believe you can actually respect now i know when the game first came out uh that was not an option you were just stuck with what you had yeah an imprinted levelum look we're probably gonna call them bonfires let's be honest uh, becomes your checkpoint and surrogate. Whenever you are shattered, you will reform the last created surrogate. As you reform, so will most prey. Use their mass to develop your vessel. Shard of the womb you once inhabited can be used as such again. Alright, what do we got here? So we can dash through there and pick up this. Unformed finger, 100. So I think that is like a... Uh, <laughs> what we would call on stream a crunchable maybe a little more crunchy because it's rock um, basically we can consume that to gain some mass uh, you'll notice right now too that we don't have a weapon that will change a little secret spot down here um, we will eventually get equipment um, but right now all we have to defend ourselves is our uh Oh, he dropped an item. Sharp nail with a fingertip formed at the end can be thrown to mildly annoy foes. Um, level him dust looks like a, like a homeward bone. Interesting. Oops. I do like that these early enemies... Oh, this is a... Uh... Gotcha. A little secret passage there and get some ardent sand and use the next absorb grants a hundred percent more breath oh, that's interesting again breath is so we have yawn get away you uglies beautiful perfection forgive me for a moment i thought you were one of my misshapen and disgusting brethren but no no you're not like them at all your proportions are sublime. Oh, flawless one, please let me serve. I can be of use to you, I promise. I will look for anything that can be of use to you. Yes, I will find you again with a gift worthy of your divine attention. Okay. I mean, we are pretty chiseled, right? Yeah, I made that joke. Um, I don't think we can reach that. Uh, oh, we could if we climb up here. There we go.
missed that one. Ooh. Wait, if he does he break these? Oh, that's interesting. Hold on. If he breaks these, are there is there stuff in it? I'm getting a small amount of mass from that, I think. We can't break those yet. I'm, I'm sure we'll be able to at some point. You know, when we get a weapon. Okay, so if we absorb that, we actually break the wall. Hmm. That looks like another breakable wall there. Can we add, like, a map marker or anything? Oh, jeez. We don't actually have... Um, like any sort of map here. I'm assuming we'll unlock that at some point. Oop. I do like that these early enemies, I think I was going to say this and interrupt myself, but I do like that these early enemies kind of just push you at first. They don't actually uh, injure you. So let's see, we can, we can probably get a couple of level ups here. Let's use a little bit of this extra mass. And, uh, might not actually want to spend anything yet. Uh, I seem to remember from the demo, I think I, I was interested in dexterity and resonance. Um, yeah, let's actually, uh, just one more of those. Let's start with that. Probably should wait till I pick up an item, but I'm gonna guess the first time we find a weapon, it's not gonna have particularly high requirements, so. Ooh, he dropped a, uh, dropped a thing. Oh, you know what? I don't even have to go this way. What am I doing? We made a we made a shortcut. Uh, probably gonna need some force at some point too. Hello. And you notice, yeah, we uh, we actually had absorbed enough of the uh, the hands to uh, to have it as an option. Oh, there's Yawn again. Flawless one. May I find a gift worthy of you. The glorious Carvin. Use these stick things to more easily crush their disgusting lessers into useful materials. A mall axe. One of the many varied ways to crush prey. Okay, so we can equip things. Looks like this has C scaling with strength and dexterity, and E scaling. Oh, special attack can shift its fingers into the shape of an axe, dealing increased damage with increased staggering power to prey. How do we use a special attack, I wonder? Um, first of all, I'm going to actually go back. I know this seems crazy already to be doing this stuff like this, but um, I want to get this door or wall. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, you look mean as heck. I don't know if I could absorb you. I probably could. Hmm, how do I... Oh, there we go. Maybe I need the full combo to do that. There we go. Yeah, we'll fix it for you. Oh, I got an item. Finger blade. Oh, and I got myself stuck on his limbs. Oh, geez, that's brutal. Um. Oh, interesting. Each swing breaks a breaks a large finger off the blade, launching it forward. Special attack causes multiple. And this requires two 
Resonance. Interesting. How do we do special attacks? Is that? Oh, okay, I see. So triangle, or, or Y, I guess, if you're going by Xbox buttons. Can we do like a uh, dash attack or anything? Oops. I don't think so. Oh, we can hit these. Special attack is very potent. So we already have all those, right? Oh, wow. Can I special attack in midair? I can. Oh, that does the slam. All right, cool. There's some sparkles guiding us, it seems. Beacon attuned. What's a beacon? Oh, map information, nice. Okay, we can remove this marker, actually. Um, so let's see, we still need four boulder heads, one crawler, one ancient limb. Attacking and dashing consumes force. Yeah, his actions can't be initiated. Cannot be moved by will, will be moved by force. Yeah. Oh, there was an enemy. Oh, we could have absorbed him, huh? All right, so we got enough of those. Spikes there? Yeah, there were. Hmm, it's a new creature over there. Oh. Can't break that, it seems. This is interesting. Red attacks can't be absorbed, you can dash through enemies. So we're gonna get one of these red attacks? Oh, okay, yeah. Ooh, I gotta watch my stamina there. Holy crap, he did a lot of damage. There we go. Hunt point gained. I'm gonna achieve him for that too. What's a debris field? This is incoming damage. Uh, can we equip these? Um, let's put it on that. No, you know what? That's gonna be a terrible idea. I think actually, because so I'm gonna I'm gonna confuse myself by having them on a right button, but wanting to throw them left. Grow to gain. Hmm. Yeah, that gave us a hunt point. I don't fully know what those are. Prickly Weeper Chest. Can we equip that? Yeah. Huh. Frail Arm plus 30%. Oh, we can also just equip things as cosmetic. That's interesting. Yeah, we get some armor here. Look down. Okay. Nope, missed that. Come on, get up. No, you're not gonna get up? Alright, so be it. I don't think we can use a partial breath to heal either. Oh, 
I'll say this looks like a yeah so what happens if I absorb these does that change something on my chest piece yeah it looks like it does A lot of secret passages. Ooh. Ooh, I can absorb projectiles. That's super cool. And throw them back. Volatile eye. Gotcha. Uh, we probably want to go left though well we've already started going this way right I'm really curious what happens when I when I get enough for that chest piece let's find out right here oh twin fangs so what did that do Oh, that wasn't... Huh. Well, we can equip a second weapon and switch between them? Oh, yeah. Can we switch, like, mid-combo? Yes. That's interesting. Leap forward for a special attack. Oop, ran myself out of stamina on that one. Can we get you to attack? Oh, you're just gonna walk into me. How about that? Prickly Weeper Hands. Oh! That goes with this set. Oh, it's a set bonus. Okay, I see. I understand. Oh, the volatile eyes are bombs. Um, is there anything else we want to equip? I don't think so. I really feel like I should go back to that previous area because I'm getting way out of way out of the way here. Shortcut here. Oh. All right, so that only did half of his health. Another hunt point gained. Oh, that's gonna hurt. So if I fall too far, it actually um, kind of resets me, so to speak. So is this the other side of that, um, it is, yeah. Malformed. I, we are wrong, a mistake. And Bonnie shouldn't look like this. I can feel it, I know it. My thoughts, my words, they come from a dead thing. Cursed breath, life forced into unwilling dirt. Okay, we can open that from this side. Uh, does that... And that takes me back... That kind of takes me back around to where I was. Hmm. Alright, let's see. I go, uh, I gotta go this way, I think. That's where I want to be. Right? Yeah. There was a creature or something over here. Oh, this is probably the tutorial for you can absorb projectiles like that. Ooh, I gotta be careful here. There we go.
A lot of nails we're getting here. Oh, what's here? Interesting that this portion doesn't uncover. Kind of in a dangerous position here. Well, you know what? Let's let's do this. Let's head back. This is a good time to end the episode, I think. We get a lot of... We learned a lot. Maybe this will tell us about these hunt points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Restores 25% of your total force on a successful absorb or repel. Hmm. Generally pulls on nearby vulnerable surfaces, revealing hidden paths. That sounds useful. Yeah, we should get this. It costs two points, but I think it's worth it. Um, let's get another resonance. Oh, so this actually just show us um the bonuses we would get for these things that's cool uh let's get a, yeah let's get one resonance let's get a force mm. i don't know if we want a health i feel like i should spend another point though or i'm gonna potentially lose some. Let's try this other weapon though. Let's let's see what this is like. Huh. Not what I expected. Cuz didn't it say it Launching it forward. Short distance behind the target. Oh, okay. So when I hit something, it does that. That's really interesting. I kind of feel bad for doing this. I'm assuming these guys don't respawn because this would just be an infinite farm. Hmm. Resonance, interesting. Um. Yeah, another health is always good. Okay, so we'll stop there for now. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you soon.